Hey everyone, I wanted to come back to you again today about uh, you know our prayers that God would show us who to invite to church and uh, for God to give us favor with them that they'll actually come. This little passage, we just had a prayer meeting here at the office and this little passage that we're praying, it's found in Isaiah 43 and it's verses 5 and 6. Listen to this and this is a great scripture. I would love for you to pray this every day. Isaiah chapter 43 verse 5 and 6. Maybe you can write it out on a on an index car or a post-it note, put it on your bathroom wall or window or mirror rather, um, and just pray this every day. It says, do not fear for I am with you. I will bring your offspring from the east. I'm reading from the NASB. Offspring there being uh, uh, in terms of spiritual offspring, so souls being saved. He said, I will, I will bring your spiritual souls or your offspring from the east and gather you from the west. I will say to the north, Give them up. That's what we need to pray. We need to demand the devil, give up our harvest, souls for the kingdom of God. And then it goes on to say, and to the south, do not hold them back. What powerful prayers. Then it says, bring my sons or my spiritual sons from afar and my daughters or my spiritual daughters from the ends of the earth. I want to encourage you to, to maybe write this out, print it out, whatever you want to do, but begin to pray. Pray with authority. God, send us those. Bring us souls from the east. Gather them from the west. Speak to the north and say, do not hold them back. And from the south, keep them not back. Bring our spiritual sons from afar and our spiritual daughters from the ends of the earth. That's what we're going to pray. We're going to pray this in unity as a church. Together, every day, we're going to see God save souls. Hey, it's already working. Saturday at Dwayne and Deanna's small group in Kentucky, they had one person saved that was celebrating their 40th wedding anniversary and three others rededicated to the Lord. It gets even better. Last night at Gerardo and Leanne's small group, Four people gave their hearts to Jesus Christ, got saved for the first time. Church, we have seen eight people saved in the last three days just in small groups. So we want to pray that God send them in on Sundays. And we want to see even double that Sunday. Why don't you join me and let's pray the rest of the week. We see 16 people saved Sunday. Hey, God will do it. Pray that scripture. Be inspired. Be encouraged. And we give God praise for the soul saved in small groups. Hey, God bless you.